is an amazing place. It's a happy place. It's a place that provides second chances for animals that are needing and deserving that next best opportunity. PAWS is a companion animal shelter. We also take in and rehabilitate wildlife, offer advocacy for animals, and also have a wonderful humane education program in the schools. May I pet your dog? Yes, you may. The education programs that we do at PAWS, our humane education program, is really a long-term investment. We're reaching children in their classrooms and coming to the PAWS site to learn about animals that we take care of here, learn about animals in the community so that they will develop and nurture those inherent skills for caring and nurturing for life. Humane education is the opportunity to really open eyes early on and develop that incredible love and appreciation for the world in which we live and share with animals. And I'm so happy that you walked along because I was waiting for the right person for her. <laughs> at PAWS, we like to consider ourselves expert matchmakers. The adoption advisors at PAWS are also the people that provide care to the animals. So when a potential adopter comes in and we review their application, we can also be thinking in the back of our heads about the animals that are in our kennels right now so we can make the best match possible. I've been volunteering for 10 years at Cat City. And our goal here is to really find the best match we can between people and animals, and it's fabulous. There's nothing more rewarding than seeing one of the dogs that I walk get adopted. It's a great feeling. Come on, Molly. Come on, let's go home. I'm very proud of the aggressive programs we have to prevent overpopulation here at PAWS. Our goal is to prevent animals from coming into the shelter in the first place, and the best ways to do that are um, with spay and neuter programs. So PAWS, we offer two main programs. We spay and neuter every animal before it leaves our shelter, and we also offer low-cost spay and neuter to low-income members of the public. PAWS roots are in companion animal adoption and uh, strongly into spay and neuter. Uh, from that, we've expanded into wildlife very heavily, but people have not really recognized the enormous role that PAWS plays in, in uh, rehabilitating injured and orphaned wildlife. Part of PAWS' mission is to help people learn how to peacefully coexist with wild animals. And with the rapid pace of development here in Washington State, this is a really pressing issue. People need to know how to effectively live with those animals um, on their properties. We, we give them the information to do that successfully. The primary work we do through the, the Wildlife Hospital is to restore the health of uh, injured and orphaned wild animals with the goal of releasing them back into the wild with a good chance of survival. The animals that we see coming through the, the wildlife clinic are from black bears to bats and moles and some very, very small mammals with birds from uh, bald and occasionally golden eagles to hummingbirds and kinglets and also see marine mammals. The uh, harbor seals are the primary marine mammal that we'll see. Uh, the happy ending to the story is they're seeing the rear end of an animal running into the, the forest, knowing that they have a good chance of survival again. Come on! Keep going! Come on, Bear! We couldn't do the life-saving work that we do without the community, um, whether it's volunteers or donors or people who are just ambassadors of the organization and caring for animals. It makes a tremendous difference. Volunteers provide really the backbone of the workforce for the organization. I volunteer at the Wildlife Center, and my responsibilities in the morning are to move patients from their dirty cage from the day before to clean cages, food and water, and just try to make it a stress-free environment. I come here twice a week, and two, three hour shifts, and walk dogs. We try to work with them a little bit, and I love it. Dogs are, uh, I don't have a dog of my own, and uh, so this is my fix. Well, we take home kittens and puppies that, uh, that need foster care. So it's, it's basically animals that aren't ready to be adopted yet. It's a stress relief for us, because you get to spend time with, with puppies and kittens, and by the time they're old enough, they're big enough, they go and find their forever homes. And you know that they probably wouldn't be able to do that if foster care programs didn't exist. <laughs> Pause is hope. Pause is a progressive organization. Pause is heart. Pause is volunteering. Pause is education. Pause is a second chance.
Paws is outstanding. Paws is indispensable. Paws is fun. Paws is baby puppies. Paws truly is people helping animals. Paws is us. Awesome.